Hello everybody, my name is Nathan Sifu, and welcome to Mass Effect 3. Let's play. And here we go from <laughs> starting Mass Effect 3, and automatically I'm disconnected from Xbox Live for some reason. I feel like that's a bad idea, I should probably do that. Oh my god, here we are, finally, with Mass Effect 3. And, I mean, by the time this video goes out, it'll... For quite a long time, Mass Effect Andromeda will be, you know, available. But I've been waiting so long to get to this point. I'm I'm so excited to play this game. I, I've literally just finished uh, my playthrough of Mass Effect Two, and I, I took out the disc and stuck in this one. I've still got, you know, quite a bit of time left on the clock for me to play tonight. And um, this is awesome. This is the, this is the this is the pinnacle. I I. I almost, I almost didn't imagine I would ever, that I would ever make it to here, because I had never, you know, when I had first started this whole journey of being able to do Let's Play videos, I didn't even think I was going to be able to, to do it at all, because I was restricted to using the Xbox One Twitch app, and now, here I am. Um, shoot, unfortunately, hmm. I have to do a little bit of a jump cut because I got to connect to Xbox Live, but here we go. Okay, so that was a little bit annoying. I had I had a little bit of an issue, and uh, the Xbox actually completely froze. But I'm back now. Um, sucks because it means that I actually have had to do like a two different recordings because I had to reboot the Xbox. Stupid thing. All right, so we are doing a brand new game. Um, Sort of, it's almost tempting to do a little bit of multiplayer. I probably will include a little bit of multiplayer in this playthrough just because uh, it's technically part of the story, but anyway. Uh, import, import ME2 character. Okay, here we go. So, let's see, there's 26, 2016? No, this is 2017. Well, it's okay. Well, it's it's clearly out of all of these, it's the latest, the one with the latest date. So, yeah, that's got to be it. Class Vanguard. Oh, yeah, yeah, Vanguard. Okay. That's what I, okay. Save the Rat Knight Queen. Rescued Ashley Williams on Ver Vermeer. Chose to sacrifice the Council. Saved Malin's data. Kept Rex alive on Vermeer. Chose to destroy the Geth heretics. Destroyed the collector base. Survived the suicide mission with 12 squad mates. Uh, romance Liara before M ME2. Romance Tally in ME2. In uh, and, oh, that's, okay, that's all the decisions, I guess. Okay. Um, uh, yeah, import character. Definitely. That is all the major decisions. Wow, I'm uh, I'm excited to be playing this right now. This is seriously one of my favorite fucking games, man. And uh, I am going to customize the appearance of the face a little bit. I am just going to change it up a little bit because the eyes are a little fucked up. Let's see. Okay, maybe I will. Maybe I will confirm that selection. Okay, so in previous previous playthroughs, I've done the soldier. I've I have done the infiltrator, and I've done the vanguard. And so, and so far between the two of those, the infiltrator and the vanguard are very close. Very close match in terms of which one is more fun. Um, I think the Vanguard has to win, though. That bi that biotic rush, man, it's, there's nothing beats that. Um, the Sentinel, I mean, you got some good abilities, but honestly, I'd rather just get those some of those abilities from my teammates. Uh, yeah, same there. Yeah, same there. Okay, vanguards are feared for their high-risk, high-reward combat style. 
closing quickly on enemies and destroying them at short range with weapons and biotic abilities. There are outfits with L5N implants enabled, enabling them to perform bi a biotic charge that strikes the opponent with incredible force while bringing the Vanguard closer uh, for closer range combat. Incinerary ammo, cryo ammo, biotic charge, Nova, which is such a game changer, and biotic charge, and pull. Okay, uh, personal records. You uh, your accomplishments give you access to the following bonus uh, powers. Please select one: Carnage, rip uh, rip a target to shreds with a vicious blast. Majority of clutter, uh, uh, not really. Marksman, a boost your weapon accuracy and firing rate for a short time. Proximity mine, fire. Wow, there's a lot in this list. Gee, I should go through these and okay. Um, fire a stick mine into traffic and detonate it when the enemy is close. Nah. Uh, decoy, distract enemies with this decoy. Um, I'm gonna need more of a description than that. Uh, defense drone, deploy a holographic drone to electrocute enemies for firing range. That's pretty cool. Energy drain. That's what I was using before, which I might I might go back to that again. Um, now stasis stasis was completely useless in Mass Effect One and Two, but in Mass Effect Three it actually is useful. It freezes them and you can do damage. Um, not sure if that's what I want. Not sure if that's what I want or not. Uh, energy drain was very useful a lot of the time. Um, Barrier, ooh. Reinforce armor with mm. defense matrix. Fortification, they're all kind of the same idea. Armor piercing, ooh, armor piercing rounds. Slam. Dark channel, whoa. Plague an opponent with a persistent damaging biotic field. Effects transfer onto a second target if, uh, if the first is killed. Effects... Uh, length depends on the dark channel's uh, duration. Only one field may be available at a time. Dominate. Disrupt and sy synaptic harmonics of an organic brain uh, so it can't differentiate between friend and foe. Ooh. So it's basically hacking, but for biologicals, uh, a single effect to target will, f will fight alongside time. Uh, targets grow resistant to the power over time. Flare. Focus and expand all... Whoa, what? Focus and expand all bionic energy to unleash a huge flare that throws enemies within its range, causing massive damage. Oh. Man, I really... <gasps> Lash? Hold on a second. Lash. Latch on enemies with a biotic lash and rip them off their feet, uh, dealing moderate damage. Okay. I can always change this bonus one later. I think I gotta at least try that. Mmm, it's tempting. Yeah, let's let's go for something new. Come on, let's do it. Uh, I guess hard drive. Nathan Shepard. Bonus power slash. I, I think, and I, th yeah, I'm pretty sure I can change that. Like I, like I was able to do that in Mass Effect 2. You just go somewhere on your, on the Normandy and you just swap it out. I hope I'm not wrong about that. I hope I'm not stuck with that ability forever. Because chances are I am going to want to switch back to something that bring to, brings down shields. But, uh, in fact, I can almost guarantee that I'm going to want to do that. Oh well. Electronic Arts presents a Bioware production. Are they gonna meet make me read the shit at light speed? How bad is it? Bad. We just lost contact with two of our deep space outposts. There's something massive on long range scanners. Is this what Shepard warned us about? I'd stake my life on it. You should have listened. Have. Not long. I sent word. The fleets are mobilizing. God help us all.
2157, humanity discovered it was not alone in the universe. 30 years later, they found a peaceful place among uh, dozens of galactic species. But this idyllic future is over, uh, overshadowed by a dark past. Rapers. A sentient race of machines responsible for cleansing the galaxy of all. Holy shit, that's way too fast. Fuck you guys. <laughs> Oh, aren't you funny? <laughs> he had to trick us with the whole, you know, not a real ship trick. Commander. You're not supposed to call me that anymore, James. Not supposed to salute you either. We gotta go. The defense committee wants to see you. Sounds important. You can't toss an iPad like that, dude. What's going on? Couldn't say. Just told me they needed you. Now. Anderson? Admiral? You look good, Shepard. Maybe a little soft around the edges. How are you holding up since being relieved <laughs> from duty? It's not so bad once you get used to the hot food and soft beds. We'll get it sorted out. What's going on? Why is everyone in such a hurry? Admiral Hackett's mobilizing the fleets. I'm guessing words made it to Alliance Command. Something big's headed our way. The Reapers? We don't know. Not for certain. What else could it be? If I knew that. Uh, we should have prepared more. You know we're not ready if it is then. Not by a long shot. Tell that to the Defense Committee. Unless we're planning to talk the Reapers to death, the Committee is a waste of time. They're just scared. None of them have seen what you've seen. You faced down a Reaper. Hell, you spoke to one, then blew the damn thing up. You've seen how they harvest us, what they plan to do to us. You know more about this enemy than anyone. Is that why they grounded me? Took away my ship? You know that's not true. When you blew up the Batarian relay, hundreds of thousands of Batarians died. It was that or let the Reapers walk through our back door. I know that, Shepard. And so does the committee. If it wasn't for that, you'd have been court-martialed and left to rot in the brig. That, in your good word? Yeah, I trust you, Shepard. And so does the committee. I'm just a soldier, Anderson. I'm no politician. I don't need you to be either. I just need you to do whatever the hell it takes to help us stop the Reapers. They're expecting you to, Admiral. Good luck in there, Shepard. <laughs> Thanks, man. Anderson? Oh. Shepard. Ashley? Lieutenant Commander? How'd it go in there? I can never tell with them. I'm just waiting for orders now. Lieutenant Commander? You hadn't heard? No. I'm a bit out of the loop these days. Sorry, sir. Didn't mean to keep you out of the loop. Someone got a lot hotter since Mass Effect 2. <laughs> I'm sure you had your reasons. Yeah, I guess I did. Still, good to see you. Mm. Admiral. <laughs> Come on. But she's gonna go for James. You know the commander? I used to. Oh man, these people don't know what they're in for. You have no Admiral fucking clue. Shepard. What's the situation? We were hoping you would tell us. The reports coming in are unlike anything we've seen. Whole colonies have gone dark. I can feel we've the tension building. Everything beyond the soul relay. Whatever this is, it's incomprehensibly powerful. You brought me here to confirm what you already know. The Reapers are here. Then, how do we stop them? Stop them? This isn't about strategy or tactics. This is about survival. The Reapers are more advanced than we are. More powerful, more intelligent. 
They don't fear us. And they'll never take pity on us. But... There must be some way. We stand together. If we're gonna have any chance at surviving this, we have to stand together. That's it? That's our plan? Admiral, we've lost contact with Luna Base. The moon? It couldn't be that close already. That's fucking close. Like past our defenses. Sir, UK headquarters has a visual. UK headquarters. Oh, well, his mouth is all fucked up on the side. I like how they used like live action footage for, for some of that stuff there. That's neat. God, can you imagine? Why haven't we heard from Admiral Hackett? What do we do? The only thing we can. We fight or we die. We should get to the Normandy. This takes place in Canada too. That with this this scene, which is kind of cool. Oh my god! Oh. Go! 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 Oh the oh the deafening blast. Take this. We've got to get moving. <laughs> this is Admiral Anderson. Reporting what makes anyway. you say what for when he passes Lieutenant through Commander the Commander Williams, is that you? What's your status? I can't raise the Normandy. You'll have to contact me. We'll meet you at the landing zone. Anderson up. Like my camera froze for a second. Come on, Shepard. Ashley's headed to the Normandy. They'll pick us up if we can get to the space. Let's move. All right. So I think. Yeah, I think Let's I'll move. probably. I think I'll probably actually end the episode there, and then I'll upgrade like all my powers and stuff between episodes. All right. Look at that thing! Holy shit! That was fun, but I'll have to pause it there. If you enjoy my content and want to see more, do some of the stuff that the screen is telling you, and check out my other stuff. If you want to see me play live, check out the links in the description. Come talk to me, maybe even play with me. That is it for this episode, and I will see you in the next game.